guys, thanks for watching the video. Um, this is obviously the uh, Hype GTR in Ermine White, seven string model. Um, this is just uh, giving you a brief, basic rundown of uh, my personal opinion of the uh, Ormsby, the Run 1 GTRs. Um, so we had a choice of six colors. Um, I chose the Ermine White. I really dug it and um, it turned out really cool. I'm pretty happy, pretty impressed with it. Um, I, want, I just want to get the issues out of the way first. Um, firstly, um, being a production guitar, obviously the time and care doesn't get put into it as much as a custom um, as the Ormsby people know. Um, there was a bit of paint that ran on the inside of the, um, uh, the bottom horn there. Uh, you can actually see that from the photos at the start of the video, so go check that out if you want to see it. Um, uh, as far as uh, cosmetics and play playability with the guitar, that's the only issue. Um, the other, I guess, slight issue that happened uh, during the whole process of Run 1 was the uh, production time and the timelines around all that. Um, it was a lot longer than estimated due to a lot of uh, circumstances outside of um, Ormsby's hands, outside of Perry, outside of um, other people as well. So, you know, it was a it was the first run. So, you know, getting all the kinks and all that stuff, all that stuff out of the way, um, everything went really smoothly. Uh, <clears throat> things I like about the guitar and things I like a lot. Um, this is my first fan fret guitar that I've owned. I've played a couple but um, this is the fan, first fan fret I've owned and um, I can't fault the fan. It's, it's great, it feels natural, it feels really good. Um, you know, stretching from you know, first to fifth fret is not a problem, you know, those sort of things are really good. Um, so the stainless steel frets, loving them, constantly shiny, you know, so easy to keep clean, it's great. Um, the bridge, custom, uh, custom hip shot bridge made specifically for the uh, Ormsby guitars, Really comfortable, um, definitely. I would love to have this on other guitars. Um, the neck as well is very comfortable. Um, I've played a few Ibanez guitars and which thinner neck profiles uh, through to a couple of custom guitars with uh, thicker neck profiles. Um, and this, this definitely you know, fits right in there and um, feels really nice to play. Um, it's quite a fast neck as well, so that's good for all you shredders out there. It's um, really smooth to move across. And the hip shot locking tuners, so easy, so easy as you saw in the video. Pull it through, lock it off, away you go. For those that aren't really familiar with Naya, with, with locking tuners. Uh, overall, I love the guitar. It's so much fun to play. Um, I don't put it down very often. And that's the phone ringing, which is going to be in the background of the video. <laughs> Overall, I really dig the guitar. I haven't put it down that much since uh, receiving it. It's just a really fun guitar to play. It sounds great. Um, so, and with that, you know, I have considered the possibility of jumping on another run in the future. So, you know, you can't go wrong with these at the moment. And um, things are looking better for these uh, Ormsby GTRs. So, thanks guys. And thanks to everybody at Ormsby. Thanks to Perry. Mrs. Ormsby, everyone involved, Matt, all the guys, um, I can't write off all the names, I'm sorry, but to everybody involved, good stuff, and um, yeah, check them out.